record. Hey guys, it's Coyote back with you for another episode of Minecraft Parkour School again. Um, this time I'm using a texture pack. Um, just to see if you guys might like it or not. If you guys don't, I'll definitely change it. But I think it looks quite nice actually. I like this one. Um, nicer than some of them. But you know, let's get into it. Don't be surprised if I'm changing up my texture packs every once in a while because um, I really think I should get some different texture packs out so we don't always have the same texture pack every so we don't have just the default texture pack. Also that would just sort of get a bit boring I guess we can say. Because if I had just the same texture pack for every single episode, then you guys are used to every single ex episode with the same texture pack. So, well, I'll just change it up every once in a while. I actually like this one a bit more because it's um, it's actually quite nice on the eyes. I think it's pretty smooth. Um, it's not, there's nothing really like different about it. It's actually really nice. I don't know why people wouldn't like it, because look at it. It's pretty nice. I might do the rest of the series with this texture pack on, just because of how nice it is. Look at the house over there. That's beautiful. Like, I don't know how the creator figured out how to do something like this, but it's probably the best texture pack I've ever played with. It's amazing. Like it's sort of like old fashioned style. And I, I, I like that kind of style, so it's me, that's for sure. I might play with it a bit more on um, this texture pack, play with some more like mini games and stuff. If you guys don't like it, tell me, I'll change it. But every once in a while I'll still do a texture pack, okay? Or um or I'll put in the description a texture pack that you guys want to see. And I'll do and I might be able to get you guys that texture pack out there, okay? So, texture pack you guys want to see, or if you guys don't like tex the texture packs and you just want the default blocks. Whatever you guys want, I'll do it. Just because I am not gonna argue with you guys, because, um, you're what, I'm basically doing this all for you, so that's what you guys want. That's what I get. So, yeah, choose your stuff. If you guys don't like this series, um, I'm sorry about it, but this is a hard, actually, parkour course. If you guys have been watching the other episodes, yeah, I've been having quite a bit of trouble on it. Like, everyone, every episode, I'm stuck on the spot. And I guess this episode's gonna be this one. Uh, so annoying. I think that slow sand is actually probably one of the annoyingest. Because you run really slow and then when you get to the jumping part, you like go bang. And you have f fast, fast, fast speed. Oops, that was a fail. Guys, that was a really fail. For... For what it matters, guys, I'll always be doing, um, maps. Because I, I like maps. They're fun. Like, like, some, like, those dropper maps for 1.8, right? Those are always fun. And stuff like that. Nothing crazy hard or anything. And I do a lot of Minecrafting off camera. Like, on my own worlds and stuff. I do a lot of work on these videos, so... Yeah, like and a thumbs up and a rating would be more than enough appreciated, that's for sure, guys. Um, look, redstone down there, it's, I can't really read the la those 27 things. It's, oh, it's so red. Oh, no, I did, mm. yeah, it's pretty red. See, every block is newly textured. I don't know if, like, slime blocks or anything are newly textured or stuff, but... Um, yeah, I actually 
enjoy this texture pack. If you guys like my Mindplex videos, say so. I'm um, I'm gonna always do Mindplex videos and full on surviving series. And tomorrow I'm starting up the Crazy Craft. So I always have um a kind of series going, right? And it, it never really matters what kind of series I'm doing. Just you, just to let you guys know, so I'm always doing a series. Always want to be doing a series. But, oh no! Yeah, they should really smell the fires out here. Yeah, guys, if it wasn't burned, if there wasn't a fire here, I would have broken it, but because I can't break it, then, yeah, I can't break it. Sorry, guys, if I'm a bit tired. Slept in today. I need to get a video done, so I just decided to do this because it was quick and easy for me. Um, I know what you guys are thinking. You guys didn't want to see this one probably this morning or whenever you're watching it. You guys probably didn't want to see this. You wanted to see, like, another Mindplex or something. But, um, yeah, I'm sorry about that. It's, um, a bit slow lately. Haven't really been doing, getting much feedback from you guys. More like, dude, I shared your video with my friend. Or stuff like that. I'm not getting much feedback. And that one month thing, I haven't got a single question yet to answer. Oh, oh look at that. That's so cool. Hey guys, I haven't got a single question yet to answer. If I would have had a single question, then I might answer it, but you still haven't given me a single question. No. No. Single question to answer, guys, for this whole month. Uh, come on. Turn night. Whatever. Yeah, if you guys would have given me a question for the end of the month, I would easily answer it. Don't worry about that. Just you guys haven't given me a, a single question. And not, if you don't give me a question, then, then you don't get the question they're asking one. So it's either if you guys want it or not. I think it'll be fun because it's actually a pretty neat little thing um, to do. Most people don't do it. So like once a month, I answer one question. And you guys haven't been giving me in questions, so... I don't have any yet, even though I really badly think we should get a couple of questions, so that I'm just prepared. Like, I'll write them down and everything, be really prepared for them. Just, I don't, you guys, if you guys aren't going to give me them, then how am I going to be prepared? So, then I would have to make up my own questions, like one of my own questions to answer for you guys. And I want a good question from the group. And I'll say who it's from and everything, but I want a good question. Guys, not like, what's their middle name or something stupid like that. I don't want those. Those are bad questions. But, um, it's something that actually is meaningful, right? Something that's really meaningful. Um, like, you think that would be a good question? Like if you were a YouTuber and you want, and you were doing it, and you didn't want, you wanted people, and you were doing it, and you wanted people to ask you, do give a question like that, okay? Give a question that you think will be pretty meaningful, but not like, oh, meaningful, like oh my, that's crazy talk, like something, that, like not questions like. Do you believe in Bigfoot or something like that? Don't no, nothing like that. I don't like those questions. They're always so stupid and dumb. So give a question that actually has some thought into it. Okay, something that actually has some pretty well-known thought into what the person was saying to you. If you're just saying like these wee little things. That don't mean much. 
like, do you believe in, um, this? No. Like, no, I won't answer that. Those. Because they're so annoying to answer. So, yeah, I won't do those things. Those are annoying. But, um, I'll definitely, if anything, I will be answering the questions that are, like, actually have some meaning into them. Like, someone actually probably put a thought into it. You can never tell if they put a thought into their questions. So, like, a question like that. A thought. It's so dark here. This is annoying sometimes. Uh, I'm almost there. Uh, I'm just gonna check a spawn, just in case. Uh, oops. Oh, let's just put a dash there. Yeah, guys, sorry about that. I'm just trying to um, make sure that if I fall, see, like that, once I get to those hard parts, is that I don't spawn back at the very beginning every single time. I work my way back up. Because that's a bit annoying sometimes. So I think that spawn point is actually going to still be a challenge. Still going to be a challenge to complete, but um, at least I have it right, so it's better than not having a spawn point. I, w I wish they would change like your skin to these texture packs because now like your skin doesn't match them, right? So it's like, why don't you change them? Make them both match. Slash you. Oh. Oh yay! Checkpoint eight. Oh, sorry, night. Better. So we made it to a new checkpoint. That's good. That's always good to be at a new checkpoint once a day, once once a time. This might take more than I thought to defeat this game. Um, ice, bit, oh, I hate ice parkour. Because you're always so slippery and slidey. See? I don't know why my hunger is going down. Was it going down at the beginning of the series? Because I'm just pretty sure my hunger never went down. But now it's like dropping. I'm going to start losing lives because of my hunger. Do you know what would be crazier if this person did? Put the scoreboard. Put a scoreboard on this and decide, like, you get, like, two, tw 40 lives to defeat the parkour course. And then, like, the world automatically deletes. That would be pretty crazy. If that's what the owner decides to do with it, well, that'd be a really crazy part of course. I don't know about you guys, but I'd be like, whoa, 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 whoa. You, you did that? Like, that's something that everyone would be like, huh? Like, the guys who are trying to YouTube it, like, they die after about 20. And everyone's like, and then he's like, what? Like, the game's already over? they're kicked right on like the first video so that would be a bit stupid though I don't know why he would do that but it maybe if it was like a hundred two hundred lives then that would so sound more reasonable everyone would probably agree if it was more like a hundred two hundred lives but because it isn't then mm -mm. oh man yeah, I play a lot of basketball. And then one of our best players on my team, I'm a good player. Like, I'm post, if you guys don't know what post is, it's one of those guys that goes, races to the net and gets the pass up by the net and takes those shots. 
So I play a lot of posts that way and take a lot of jump balls. But my buddy who also does that, he um broke his wrist in the last game. So now he's he's out for maybe the season. But we were one of the best teams out there until he broke his wrist. Because we lost one of our best players. If we wouldn't have lost, if he wouldn't have broken his wrist, then he would still be playing around with us. So, but just because he broke his wrist is why we didn't um, get like first. If he wouldn't have broken his wrist, that game would have been a whole different series, but, um, yeah, it's a bit sad when that happens to one of your teammates to break their wrist or something. Oh, uh, so annoying. Can't get this. I can't get this. Mmm. So hard. Uh. Yeah, guys, I don't know about you guys, but this is pretty tough. I'm going to try to get out two episodes today. I'm not sure if I'm going to. Crazy Craft, tomorrow, set date. It's engraved in concrete, guys. Tomorrow is when I'm going to start the series. So, don't. So, if you guys don't see an episode of Crazy Craft today, don't worry. If you guys see it tomorrow, then you guys know that I... Like, that's in paved in cement. I'll make sure I get that video done. If anything, that's the one video I'm going to do, guys, for you. Is that crazy craft. In paved in cement. Like, nothing will get me out of there. We're doing crazy craft that day. Oh, I can't get that jump. Oh, guys, um, we're gonna end it here, I guess. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, rating would be much appreciated, like, much appreciated. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Share this with your friends, and see you guys next time on Parkour School. Bye.